Oh. oh, how funny. I wondered what had happened to that fan. It wasn't given to your father, it was given to me. Who by the Tsar? No, no. Not by the Tsar, no. No. No, we were at a ball in the Winter Palace. And it was, oh, it was so hot. There were icicles outside the window, but the rooms were as hot as the tropics. I was wearing it was pale blue velvet trimmed with silver lace. And when I gave you this fan, you hid it in your reticule in case Lord Grantham should be angry. Good heavens. I hope you can forgive me. But when I knew the others are coming, I could not resist the temptation. This is amazing. You know each other. You met in St. Petersburg. We did. Allow me to present my son, Lord Grantham. Prince Kuragin. I'm flattered to be remembered. How is the princess? Well, I hope. I don't know. Why don't we go back to the hall and have some more tea? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Stop giving me such knowing looks. I met the prince when I was travelling with your grandfather. Nothing could have been more respectable. Whatever you say. Away with your impertinent conclusions. My only conclusion is this. I know now you understand my predicament far better than you let on. Have you made plans to see your admirer again? Drive on. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>